Hello and welcome back to the training. So in this video, I'd like to share with you how you can find the keywords that matter for your CTR campaign. Now, there are a couple types of keywords that you need to be focused on and there's a particular order that you need to follow. So let me go ahead and jump into the tool so I can go ahead and show you exactly what you're looking for. So for this example, what we are looking at is SEO consulting. I do SEO consulting, so this is something near and dear to my heart. Now, when I'm looking at SEO consulting, my number one piece that I want to do is I want to then find the top ranker. So for this particular example, it's going to be LSEO.com. So what I did is I went over to SEMrush in this particular example, and I pulled in their organic research for their primary root domain. So as you can see, organic research, put their domain, root domain I'm in the country that they're getting their traffic from and then I'm then looking for a couple of things in particular and I actually have them ordered here let's cover them now so if you take a look at this you can see that the number one ranker and I suggest that you do ranker number one ranker two and ranker three to come up with a mean and or an average so you know exactly what type or what type of levels you need to start sending traffic to your asset so let's start with the number one piece because this is the most important now branded traffic is before anything else and this is what you're going to start sending in before any keyword traffic I want you to take a look at something because this pattern is almost on every single site and this is what every other SEO I've talked to has been skipping so let me go ahead and show you this when we're looking for a primary keyword for the domain regardless of the keyword if you take a look here up towards the very top no matter what it is you're going to see one of the main if you see a top ranker one of the main traffic sources is for branded searches so if you have a brand new website or if you're just not getting that rank one of the very first steps especially if you're targeting a primary keyword say like seo consulting i need to see what the traffic gap is much like an on-page gap or a link gap is i need to see what's the traffic gap how many branded searches how much recognition are they getting compared to me so these are the numbers if i want to compete for this keyword and this guy is the top competitor when i look and see i could see that hey this guy is getting actually 10 percent of his traffic 208 clicks per month just for his brand so that needs to be noted go ahead and take that down so we're looking at our branded traffic now again when we start setting up our campaign this is what we this is the first campaign that we're going to run and we're going to continue to run as we start sending in our keyword traffic after week one so week one branded then as we move on we're going to start sending in our keyword traffic again don't be in a rush take your time we're in it for the long haul we don't want a quick win and then smash we want to gradually climb customer revolutions right like a normal like a normal procedure it you, you get what I'm saying hopefully you're with me so first and foremost we need to figure out okay our branded traffic we want to take a look and we want to take a note the next piece is the primary keyword so we need to look and see the primary keyword that we're targeting how much traffic for the primary are they receiving so for this instance it was SEO consulting I then went over here and I see okay for this domain it's hundred and eighty the entire domain again you know this is a tip that I want to give you for this training you know Google ranks pages yes but when we're looking at traffic as a metric it's overall all right so I want you to keep this in mind you know it's an overall piece all right so I'm looking at when I'm sending it in when I'm sending it in whether it goes to the home page or an internal page it's always going to click through and go to the main ranker but that's later on in the training so first and foremost is branded then we're going to go for our primary keyword what's the amount then we're looking at variations variations are any time that the primary keyword or a portion of the keyword or a partial match whatever you want to call it I call it variations could be wrong but a partial or a variation of that keyword has been used so for this instance we're only looking for keywords that are actually getting traffic all right like 
a decent amount of traffic, like actually a smidge of traffic that matters. So for this instance, it's SEO consulting company, SEO consulting and SEO consulting firm. Now we do not just base our traffic off of what the tools say. We don't base our traffic off what we think. We base our traffic off the leading competitors every time. We're always mapping our keyword traffic and our branded traffic based off of the top competitors. This is our best blueprint every single time. So after that, the next step, after the variations, which I've gone on and I have uh, marked down here, I've marked their numbers, the amount that they're getting, and actually the words, because later on this will be used for our campaign. Then the last step is LSI phrases or co-occurring phrases. So words that are often coming up. So for my industry, you know, SEO consulting, what other type of traffic should I be receiving? What is semantically related? What's an LSI word or an LSI phrase that I could also send in? Another key trick that I really like to do is what I, is this. So if I'm looking for SEO consulting, let's come over here. What I'm looking for is this. I like to scroll down to the bottom and I see these down here, SEO consultant salary, SEO consultant job, SEO consultant jobs, SEO consulting companies. What I'm looking for is in the top one, two or three competitors, are they receiving any of these that are down here searches related to my primary keyword? Because if any of them are receiving any one of these, that's the exact traffic that I want to start sending in. So for this instance, let's go ahead and take a look briefly. What we're looking for is SEO consulting services. All right, SEO consulting companies, which I believe that we have on our list already. So that's really good. There's company, SEO consulting companies, SEO consultant, consultant marketing services, SEO link building. So let's take a look here. Let's bring this down. All right. Cause I just want to make sure if they're getting any of these, this is always going to be better. I also like to see this best SEO consultant. Um, I, I really, really like these. So firm consultant job descriptions, uh, companies, because if I cannot find it inside of the actual traffic that my leading competitor is receiving, then when I'm setting up my campaigns, what I like to do is I like to run a little bit for each of these. So anything that's related to the primary, I like to start sending in traffic in small amounts to the related searches. You know, I, I call this the LSI traffic or co-occurring traffic. All right. So this is going to break down this particular video for keywords. So I look forward to seeing you in the next video. I'll see you then.